I wish more people could see what I see. So I hope you share this code that I'm about to present, guys, because there's undeniable facts. You don't have to like football for this. You don't have to understand the code. You have to just be open-minded. So on the 22nd of August, 2022, nine-year-old Olivia Corbell got shot dead in Liverpool, so we're told. And five days later, Liverpool win 9-0 versus Bournemouth, who they would go on and lose to 1-0 exactly 28 weeks later. So in this 9-0 win for Liverpool, the star player was number nine, Roberto Firmino, got two goals and three assists. First two goals of this game were scored after three minutes and six minutes. Three plus six equals nine. So you've got number nine, Roberto Firmino, being awarded the man of the match in a 9-0 win. And then Cashman, who murdered Olivia Corbell, the nine-year-old, was sentenced to 42 years, the day of Firmino's fellow countryman, Gabriel Jesus' birthday, who wears number nine for Arsenal, whose nickname is The Gunners. And Cashman is the infamous gunman who shot dead nine-year-old Olivia Corbell. So in this game, guys, Harvey Elliott scored and so did Fabio Carvalho. Now look at this. Liverpool duo slammed for gun celebration days after tribute to Olivia Pratt Corbell. Fabio Carvalho and Harvey Elliott, both players who scored in the 9-0 win against Bournemouth, have both been the subject of criticism on social media after the Liverpool pair did a gun celebration at the end of their win over Newcastle United. And look at number nine, Firmino, smiling. Can you not see how deeply satanic this is? You do not need to understand the code or watch football to see what's going on here. It just requires an open mind. So... The nine-year-old was killed by Thomas Cashman, who was originally sentenced 42 days after he killed the nine-year-old and then later sentenced to 42 years, whilst Liverpool earned 42 points. As you can see here, 42 points they're on. Cashman gets sentenced to 42 years for murder, for murdering a nine-year-old girl from Liverpool, Notice Liverpool are on nine season losses and they're on 42 points. And today, the day after Cashman was sentenced to 42 years, Liverpool are playing Chelsea. Not long ago, their coach was Thomas Tuchel. But Chelsea have spent more cash than any other team this season. Can you not see this? Guys, Liverpool, 42 points. Cashman, sentenced to at least 42 years for murdering a girl in Liverpool. A nine-year-old girl, whilst Liverpool are on nine losses. Liverpool's first game since the nine-year-old was shot dead. They won by nine goals. Where their number nine was the star player, who's done next to nothing for the rest of the season. Because it's not about their ability, it's about the code. It's as simple as that. So I don't know what else I can do. The work I put out is beyond undeniable. And it's not just about predicting who's going to win games, guys. It's far bigger than that. Far bigger than that. I don't believe this happened for a second. I don't believe it. And if it did happen, guys, if you're going to tell me it did happen then we completely live in a coded reality. But personally, I think we're being deceived by the devil. That's what I believe. Well, most people are. I'm not. So anyways, thanks to everyone who supports me. I keep saying it. Thanks to the new people signing up. I'm going to do a video later why UConn won the NCAA final, why I coded them to win it weeks ago with one of the most undeniable codes I've ever done in my life. You're going to love that one. So anyways, guys, 
Let's see what happens in this Liverpool-Chelsea game, shall we? What rituals are at play? Chelsea, who just fired the coach on April the 2nd, 4-2. It's just an absolute joke, isn't it, guys? It's an absolute joke. Just like it's an absolute joke that Liverpool on 12 wins and 6 draws and their old coach was Brendan Rodgers, who just got fired, whose birthday is 126. And 1,260 days is 42 months. We live in a coded reality. And I show it every single day. Much love. Take care. God wins.